We are here, it's Wednesday, it's rest day. Usually we'd video physio, conditioning. We've actually added something to our uh, recovery days. Something called mobility, which I don't really know. I didn't know it was in the dictionary and stuff. I don't know much about it. I thought gymnasts do that, but we've got a mobility coach here. Hi guys. Big Sean Clark. <laughs> hey. So uh, yeah, it's yeah. going to be fun. I, we did it for the first kind of time last week and it was uh, very, very funny. I was very this mobile. Boy, <laughs> this boy's flexible, guys. Jesus. This hey, look. So uh, <laughs> <laughs> we're going to get inside and we're going to take you through 45 minute mobility with strong men. So we just run us through what we're doing today. So we're just going to run through a bit of everything, starting from the wrists up to the shoulders, a little bit of back, and then go into the lower body. That's all we're going to do, it's just mobility, a little bit of flexibility as well. We're just waiting for Luke, we always have to wait for him. Uh, but I'm ready. In my gear, look at this. Look oh, at this, the downward dog. Right, let's do this. Starting off a little bit of wrist work. We'll just start with stretching out. Get your fingers pointing back. <laughs> Come on. Oh yes, it's got them. <laughs> That's a pee pee. So five seconds of pushing your body back away. Stretch your wrist down, five seconds. Two. One, and relax. Come back out of that. It's hard getting out of it. Move the body back away, stretch your wrist out. Two, three, four, five, and relax again. One more. Best in the world, baby. <laughs> and again, so get your fingers back. Good. Push your body back away. So five seconds. Two, three, Four, five. So now we're That's 180 kilograms on the wrists. Jeez. So now we're going to do the clock blocks, yeah? Stretch again and then 90 degrees each way. So keep coming. Keep coming. And then we want to go back to yourself, yeah? So back. <laughs> as far as we can go. So hold. Hold. Get that right in a little bit more, look. Yeah, good. I'm back down. So 90 degrees each. Small, small, good. Background in the first position. So that's one full rotation. We're going over two more of them, yeah? So hold. Two, three. I'm back around 90 degrees at a time. Good. So hold. Two. Never seen three, someone made so much noise. 90 degrees background again. So 90 degrees each one. Good. Pitch off your dinner. Good Tom, that's good flexibility in the rest. Oh, oh, compliments already. <laughs> Barely! Tom, that's why I'm the best in the world, baby. Oh, oh. <laughs> I'm back right now. Just give me my leg forward, that's good. And go, we'll go with that for that one. Good. Good. So we've started with a bit of upper here, and we've moved into lower, so with the upper, like starting with wrists, then into shoulders, that's really going to help the boys with any pressing. How was that, Tony? That was great. That's one of my favourite ones. As you can see, my wrists are very flexible. I got a compliment from my coach as well, so 10, 10 stars for me. Boom. Last week I could only do like 190. Now I can do 290s, so. Now we're in position on push press and like front squats and stuff as well, so it's a very beneficial thing to do. Now we're going to dislocate our shoulders, that's good. So for shoulder dislocations, I'll give you this one, but we're just going to come up. The narrower you hold it, the harder it's going to be. Just right oh, around 10 of them, yeah? So each one, try and feel like you maybe take your hand in a little bit more. Oh, back so round, and back round, yeah. This is what I'm going to want. So 10 of them, yeah? What, just at the same? No, each one's moving on in a little bit more, so it should push out a little bit harder. So, yeah, right round your back, and back round. <laughs> so, two. That's one, sorry. This. This. Yeah, move it in a little bit now. So, your back up now. Oh, That'll be easier. Right, here we go. Come on. Feel like a black belt. <laughs> 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 Longer on it, here. <laughs> <laughs> Did the join two together with me? <laughs> How can you come to that? No way. I just didn't open that. That's fine. That. 
force me, Sean. Come on, force me. Force me. I can't. Come on. Lower back rotation is next. One leg comes up and just twist, yeah? 30 seconds on each side, twice. So left, left side, the right yeah. side. Yeah, so pull that up, grab that with the opposite arm. All right. Keep All right. that shoulder down, yeah. pull that down, yeah? Keep this leg straight. Yeah. Try to keep that down the whole time, yeah? So 30 seconds, we've got another 20 minutes. Yeah. Three, two, one, swap sides. Just the exact same on the other side now, yeah? Get him a puffer. <laughs> Arsenal. Any six guys. You think he's been lifting 100 kilograms? What is up with him? Jeez. I don't know how he's raised 100 kilos. I thought I was the end of it. I swapped back the other leg now. Who's scared of you? I'm only joking. Oh. Stay where you are, just make sure you've got enough room to reach right round though. So we're gonna just flip onto your side. Hands on. As big a circle as possible and if you find a tight spot, just sit there and the whole time you want your hand to be on the ground, don't let it come off. And let your keep your knees on the ground as well and keep this shoulder down and we're gonna come right round. So you fire it on top. Yeah. Okay, and then, yeah, and then, and then you're drawing a circle right down there, as big a circle as you can, and if you find a sore spot, say it's there, just hold it, yeah? Hold. Go right down real slow though, yeah? Just keep the hand on the ground. Very strong men up out there. Do this, you become the best. And swap sides up for this one, yeah? So five more and off to the side now. Good. Draw a bigger circle each time. <laughs> oh, I'm stuck! <laughs> Damn it. Right, if I'm moving up the way. The aim here is when they come round and they find a, a spot that's a little bit tighter, a little bit sore, they're just going to hold there maybe 5-10 seconds and then twist right round. So we're getting a little bit of work in the shoulder and the back because the, the goal is to try and keep the hand and the knees down on the floor but if the guy's being so big it can be quite hard to keep that all down. Huh? You managed this one last week. Oh, not this one. Oh, mate. <laughs> I stopped swimming on YouTube, mate. So for the tabletop, arms here, I'm just going to come straight up, squeeze your glutes back down, so we'll do five reps, five seconds, you should also feel this going into your bicep as well, so put your arms further back a little bit and you'll feel that going down into the biceps, yeah? Squeeze the glutes for five. <laughs> come on, up. Oh, you can feel that. <laughs> Are you even trying? I'm not trying to, but I'll demonstrate, okay? One, two, three, four, five, down. How are you doing? Which one? Park. Park. I can't get the park. Yes, push to the feet. Come on, big push. Big push. <laughs> Said you're lucky, bro. <laughs> I can do this for more than five seconds if I want. Okay. <laughs> hey, oh. That was 
stay in the same position. And what we're going to do is put the arms back, start walking the bum into the heels, and then we're just going to stretch out the biceps and shoulders here. So we'll sit for about 30 seconds, and then we'll do P and F. So five seconds pushing the hands into the floor, five seconds rest. Good. Make sure you've got a good stretch of the arms going back the way. And we're going to hold there for 30 seconds, yeah? So breathe. Big deep breaths, yeah? This is your fault, Simon. This is your fault, I'm like this. You and your Saturday nights. Never again. This is your last one. Five seconds, then we're going to go into PNF, yeah? So three, two, one. Now push your hands into the floor for five. Four, three, two, one, and relax. Four, two, three, four, five, four. It's a long circle. Five. Oh. <laughs> oh. Up onto the elbows, hands behind, and we're just going to chill here for 30 seconds and then do P and F again. So five seconds pushing the elbows into the floor and then relaxing. What does it mean by P and F, Sean? Basically like five seconds of putting pressure in and then five seconds of relaxing. It's just five like seconds on, five seconds off. It's like the documents you get on computers, though. Elbows in for five. Relax. 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 Head down, hands behind your head, elbows come up, rotate nice and slow round, keep your elbows as high to the roof as you can, hands onto your back, elbows down, back up. Back round, elbows down. And that's one full rotation. Slow on the way round. Slow, good. Then push your hands round when you have to. <coughs> hands up onto your back. <coughs> elbows down to the floor. Good. Back up. And back round. Slow, good. Keep everything nice and high. On the head. <coughs> elbows down. That's one. Four more. Five minute rest period. No, come on. Okay, no rest. <coughs> Good. Back up. Elbows down. Back 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 down. It's just let that rest straight back, as deep as you can go, and back up. Should be fine about there, Luke, yeah? So now just put your hands under the plate, take that one over, Ooh. hands there, and let that's that go right back, yeah? That's a scary, scary thing. Yeah, so have you got a hold of that? Yeah. Yeah. And just hold it here. How's that feeling with a 10 plate? Is it okay? Yeah, it's You hold it? Maybe yeah, so you're back. just going to hold it for a couple of seconds, bring it back up above your head, yeah? Back round again. Is that feeling alright with the 10 minutes again? That's almost touching the floor, doesn't it, Simon? Do that sort of, That was like dead close, isn't it? <laughs> it's really close. A few inches. But I feel like it was like touching the floor. One more. This one, this one. You're going back. Yeah. Keep going, keep going. I, I, I yeah, just. Yeah, yeah. Mine's gonna touch the floor. It's touching it, is it? You ready? <sighs> Tell me how close I am. Keep going. Hey, shoot! Easy money, all day, baby. Right, so hold the deep as you can go now for 30 seconds, yeah? That's what she said. Four, three, two, one. That's that one. That felt really nice. That's the first time I've done that one and opened my lats up, opened my shoulder blades up and dealt, so oh, it felt good. Really good, mate. Really, really good. So I tell everyone, try this at home, please. It's good for you. Get that a bit central. Let that open right out. You might even want to put a five on that. And we're just going to take it back behind your head. Open back out again. 
10 reps of that. Like that, like that, like that, like that. Yeah, and then press. So that's the boys just done upper body, we've done a bit of wrists, a bit of shoulders, a little bit of back and now we're going to go down into the lower body, starting with a little bit of hips and we'll go into a wee bit of hamstrings and into the piriformis and a little bit of the groin as well. So this should, this should be fun. <laughs> I think he's got a surprise move for us as well. And I'm very scared, you know, I'm being very good at this class, so like, I should be top of the marks, top marks, whatever it's called. <laughs> With the upper, like starting with wrists, then into shoulders, that's really going to help the boys with any pressing. And even when we're into that position, we're opening out the lats as well. So obviously working on the upper body. So get your feet down onto the ground flat, push your hips in, and swivel down to the side. Yeah. And back up, <laughs> swivel back around. Try and get the knees down to the floor. You might want to go a little bit wider. Yeah. No surrender <laughs> to the mobility. <laughs> Woo! You're looking like a new British strongest man. Slash world, slash anything. Look at that. It's so Mr. Slingy, you know the things you get when you're <laughs> Christmas dressing. <laughs> Other side? <laughs> to the left, to the left. Nearly. Oh, Other side. Oh, good. Ten on each, is that twenty? Oh, yeah. yeah. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> Keep your glutes on the ground here. So let, let one leg fall in, rest the other one up on top of it. And just remember to try and keep your glutes on the floor the whole time here. So we're just going to rest up here for 30 seconds, then swap onto this side, 30 seconds there, yeah? You should feel that coming down your side. Yeah. So 30 seconds here. <laughs> Now we're going to go into the 90-90 good mornings. So that leg straight out. We'll, we'll all face the same direction to make it easier. Yeah, so all this way. That leg's just going to point straight to that wall. 90 degree angle. And then with this back leg, go parallel. And then 90 degrees. So we should have two 90 degree angles, yeah? That looks fine. Yeah. It looks like a robot the way it's shoving his feet. Now we're going to do a good morning. So for the good morning, we're just going to fall into this. Whoa. Yeah. Whoa, sorry. So, oh, sorry. <laughs> so hold. Oh. And now we're going to push the knee into the ground for five seconds. Whoa. Push it into five, <sighs> four, three, two, one. Keep your hand there. You flip the knee up into the hand now. You're not going to let it come off the ground. So up, two, three, four, five. <laughs> <laughs> That's so we're just going to do an internal rotation now, so we're going to twist back up out of that and face the other leg now. Hold for 30 seconds here, and then we're just going to do a little bit of DNF again, so twist around for 5, for the last 5, 3 reps of that, but we'll just hold for another 15 seconds. Hold. And go. Just swing his entire Try and keep that knee down, Luke. Come on, Luke. Keep that knee down as well. Try and keep that knee down as well. Try and keep it forward, you know. Right, so now twist the body round that way. So you want to try and get your torso facing round past this way. Yeah. Twist your body round that way. Oh, jeez, okay. Oh. So you want to twist round this way. <laughs> yeah. Try and keep yourself as upright as possible. 
So you might need to fall slightly forward to make it easier. We're going to lift this back leg up off the ground for five seconds. So you're going to go up, two, three, four, five, and then back down. And the first thing, watch this. Up for five. Watch this, put the other side. facing me, open that up and keep that other knee pinned down the whole time, yeah? 10 reps of this. Oh. Then in the last rep, we just want to hold for maybe 10 seconds. I heard a story that someone popped their hip and their testicles got caught in the hip joint. Um, so I get worried about doing hip stuff. That's why I'm not as flexible. Keep that knee down. Good. Open up. Up here. Up down as well. Move into the lower body, like hip swivels, um, a little bit of hamstring work as well. That's just going to help with how they can actually get into a squat, into a deadlift, and I think it's obviously important making sure that they use the right form at all times. Making sure you use the right form is going to help to avoid injury. It's going to help with like circulation and everything, well the mobility is. Doing all this sort of things just means they can get into every position a lot better and avoiding injuries obviously it's vital to making sure the boys can do their best in all comps. So, For this one, oh. we're going to go up and over like that and then you want to get this so that you can lie down onto it. I'll help you with it in a second right, so just watch. So we'll come down and you're going to hug that and lie onto the ball. And you should feel that into the piriformis, yeah? No, just hug this. So you want to just hug that as much as you can. So now we're wanting to try and get yourself round and hug that. I think you're probably too big for this one, to be no, fair. No, that's so what do you do here? See what I'm doing, Tom's up there. No, I can get this. <laughs> <laughs> you're too big, I think, yeah. We're going to have to just cut this one, because the boys are too big. <laughs> Yeah. Yes. Good. Can I put them wide? 
Well, I took his hands wide. So this is a piriformis good morning. It's going to be working the piriformis and Tom's probably feeling quite a lot of pain in here just now. And it may well actually cramp up, but you, you want to try and push through the cramp and it should dissipate. So, oh. yeah. Last one, hold for 10 seconds, remember. Yeah, so it should dissipate if you do get cramped. Try and push through it. And one side might be worse than the other, so if it is, maybe just do an extra couple of reps on that one. Good, Tom. It's my last one, mate. Right? That's about five, it's about seven, I think. not an easy five. <laughs> it's okay, I don't know. Very good. This is my uh, third week with Sean, and I've seen big improvements since I started. You know, I could hardly. I was like an old man when I first started here. All my joints felt sore, everything. You know, after the first two weeks, my hips opened up, everything's opening up. Uh, feel so much more kind of mobile in the gym as well. Like my pressing's getting better in the positioning, deadlifts getting better, squats, everything seems to not be, not be as labour as it used to be. So, yeah. This is going to be vital for our prep for Worlds, vital for our prep for Britons as well. You know, I've been doing this for three weeks and seen massive changes already and still got another one to go next week and in Britain. So four weeks off this before Britons is very vital and I think, like I said, myself and Luke are maybe the only guys doing this right every single week. So yeah, big thanks to Sean and I'm going to be like Mr. Slingy, like the people get at Christmas time. I'm going to be like that. You can stretch me as far as you can go and I won't break. I feel great. You know, after that, I vote was really sore and stuff. Everything's opened up, everything feels loose, and I just, you automatically just feel better. Your body just feels better, everything just feels great. So, yeah, I'm happy, and uh, happy Tom, happy life, innit? How was it, mate? It was good. Um, that was my second session uh, with Sean doing the mobility stuff, so um, it's something that we've maybe neglected for the last 10 years. I know, I know it's a difference, my wrists are very stiff, so when I've been pressing log, they, they don't, I don't know the name, but it's a struggle to go flat in um, my hands. So doing the wrist walks, 
um, and stretching stretching my wrists. I think that's going to really pay um, pay well in the future. You know, if we've got any barbell push press happens, I can get it lower down my shoulders, uh, especially with the hip mobility as well. That's very critical for us taking care of our hips, making sure they're nice and um, looked after and mobile. Um, again, that'll help in squats and deadlifts. Um, even picking up, you know, atlas stones, etc., etc. So it's something, as Tom says, um, we've made a a decision to do this now. I think it's going to be really um, be beneficial for us going into the prep for World Strongest Man and just be as mobile as we can because we are professional athletes. So we need to cover all bases, and that's what we plan on doing. That's what we've been doing. So um, yeah, hope you enjoyed the mobility video by the Stolten Brothers and Sean Clark. That's our mobility session done. Um, so that's Wednesday, so on Wednesdays we have, we see Neil Rooney in the morning for the natural health uh, practitioner stuff that we do. So um, we see him, then we see Ross who comes up, he's a physio working from the office. And now on the recovery day we see Mr. Sean Clark who throws in a nice mobility class, which is much appreciated. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, no problem. Thanks to Sean for uh, joining the team. <laughs> World Strongest Man 2022, 1 and 2, you have to do stuff like this to uh, be the best in your sport. So, like Luke said, we've neglected mobility for a long time, but each week we're getting better, just like you do when you lift weights and follow programs. So, with the guidance of Sean, we're going to be mobile as F-U-C-K. Hey, hey. And you're doing, you're doing classes, aren't you? Yeah, I'm doing classes. I've just actually started one every Monday morning uh, in my local town, Allness, and I'm doing one every Thursday night as well. So, Perfect. Do you just yeah. do stuff online as well? Um, well, I've actually, I have actually just started like a wee YouTube channel, just oh. doing follow-along things. That's all though it is. It's just like we warm up follow-alongs and that. So I'll be doing that for you boys as well. I'll send you like personal follow-alongs before Britain. Like, Follow yeah. him on Instagram. <laughs> Simon will link it. Simon will link all the link stuff. Link You'll link his YouTube. And just go show him some love and uh, follow some of these mobility stuff. And if you're ever up in the in Regordon Highland area, look up Sean. Like he says, Mondays and Thursdays he'll be doing his classes, so yeah. come along. Um, once we get the offices and the studio up and running, we'll be doing classes from there hopefully as well. Um, exciting times. So again, thank you very much for taking your time and trying to make us a little bit mobile. <laughs> much appreciated. No problem. Anyway guys. Stay safe, smile and stay spicy. And please don't All forget to ring that little bell. Ding-a-ling-a-ling-a-ling-a-ling. Ding-a-ling-a-ling-a-ling. <laughs> <laughs>